Good afternoon and welcome to Stair Park for the Singe League 2 match. Stranra versus Stenhouse Muir. I'm Lawrence Nelson. Alongside me in commentary is Brian Martin. Craig Murphy and Colin Ferguson are on the technical. Um, Brian, do you want to bring us up to date with the Stranra lineup for this yep, afternoon? Not a problem. OK, in goals is Luke Scullion. Number two, Scott Robertson. Four, Kyle Garvin. Five is Craig Ross, who's only changed for last week. Seven, James Hilton. Eight, Grant Gallagher. Fourteen, Dean Hawkshaw. Sixteen, Dylan Forrest. Eighteen, Scott McLean. Nineteen, Salim Quida Asa. And twenty-three, Matt Grant. On the bench is the goalkeeper, George O'Connor, number 13. Three is Sam Ellis. Six, Anton Brady. Ten, Josh Walker. Twenty-one, Scott Dunn. Twenty, Luke Watt. And thirty, Ikechi Easy. Stenhouse Muir line up for today. Stenny uh, fresh off the back of a 2-2 draw against East Fife. In goals, Connor Brennan. In front of him, Adam Corbett is 15. Five, Sean Crichton. Three, Callum Yates. Eight, Michael Miller. Six, Nat Wedderburn. Fourteen, Ross Philp. Seven, Ross Forbes. Nineteen, Willie Sewell. 10, Matty Yates, and 16, Ewan O'Reilly. On the Warriors bench, number 20, subkeeper Jay Cantley. Also 17, Michael Anderson. 18, Naya Joseph. 2, Scott Walker. 11, Adam Brown. And 9, Tam Orr. So Connor Brennan, Matty Yates, Tam Orr, all former Stranraer men. Is that what you predicted? I thought Robertson might come because at the end of the game last week, uh, Robertson had slipped into the right, but maybe try to get a goal. I don't know, but anyway. I'm going to voice a bit of criticism, uh, Brian, of the numbers on the back of these white strips. Uh, absolutely fine for us as Stranraer fans. I wouldn't like to be a visiting journalist trying to pick out those numbers, though. Uh-huh. However, we know who they are, so that's uh, job done as far as we're concerned. That's true, Lawrence. Turn to Corbett from Yates. Now here's Hilton. Oh, he's Hawkshaw. Back to Hilton. And he pulls his shot. Inches wide. Great opportunity there for Jinky Hilton. Uh, bit of chance. Some lovely play between Hilton and Hawkshaw. A uh, bit of chance, Lawrence. Not an awful lot Willie Sewell could do about that, to be honest. He was yeah. already going for the ball. And Forrest nicely evades Wedderburn, feeds Matty Grant. That's a great ball. Into the middle, and it's taken off the head of Hilton. Good defending. But here's McLean. Just a bit too Def- high. Deflected for a corner. That's a deflection indeed. Oh. And that uh, wasn't far away from Scotland. Uh. Gallagher plays it into space there, and Conor Brennan Oof. comes out of goal. Oh, it's a goal! It's a goal! What a goal what for Jenky Hilton! Jinky wow! Hilton. Jinky Hilton! Minute spots Connor Brennan off his line and first times it back into the net. Fantastic strike by James Hilton, Brian. Take a bow, my son. Take a bow. 
I'll tell you what, they don't often come off, Brian. Hilton spots uh, Connor Brennan off his line. Forbes, and it's cleared this time by Robertson. Now, Chinky will chase this. Oof! Jeez! <coughs> that's a dreadful ball by Corbett. And this time... Ah, he's, he's not as good as Chinky. <laughs> Quidereza has a go with What a Brennan. chance. So six Steny players in the box. Wait for this to come across. And Grant Gallagher gets to it first. And then the return shot skies high over the bar from Ross Forbes. Manages to, to Matty Yates. He lifts it forward for Sewell. If Sewell can get clear here, there's danger for some rat. He's staying your feet, Craig, that's it, son. Back to O'Reilly. O'Reilly. And that's held comfortably at the near post. O'Reilly manages to screen a shot past Kyle Garvin. Luke Scullion's first save, I think, at his lawns. I think so. And uh, I'm not convinced it was going in, but it no, was a dangerous no, move. No, he, he had to save it. Man. Mr. Nardew have found themselves under pressure instantly from that throw in. Good pressing by the Steny defence. Hawk shot can lift it in the middle this time. It's still there if somebody Matty can Grant see it. Matty Grant in And Matty yes, Grant. Matty Grant, two number two. Number two for the Blues, Matty Grant. 34 minutes in, Matty Grant doubles from last lead. Brian, that was a more successful throw in that time. Yeah, it certainly was. A bit of panic in the, the Steny defence here again, uh, Lawrence. They seem to be at six and sevens every time we go forward. Apologies, Scott. We did when he came at first, we got mixed up with a former Sunrar player. <laughs> now, Crichton lifts it high. It's still in there. Oh, well done. Here comes Steny. Here's O'Reilly. Ball in the middle. Matty Yates scores. That was a well-worked goal, Brian. Like I said, Lawrence, don't give them, don't give them a chance. Yep. It's so really the first time they've, they've had a chance in goal. Uh, and I'll tell you what was nicely tucked away with Matty Yates with the head. Yeah. Albion Rovers 2-1 up away at East Fife. Yeah. And Dumbarton 1-0 away at Elgin. A strong oh. forward again. Lovely. Matty Grant. What a chance. Oh! oh. And... Uh, that one should have been a goal, Brian. Yeah. yeah. Sal kicking the tough there in frustration. Yeah. It'd been a lovely team goal, Lawrence, if that would have been 10, I can assure you. Nice. There's Philp again. McLean's onto him again. Grant Gallagher. Where can he, where can he get help? Uh, that wasn't a good ball at all from the captain. And uh, it's not a bit fortunate there that you and O'Reilly's yeah. shooting boots were off line. Got to defend this now. And they do. They do. And come now, bring out. Bring somebody's out. got to. Oh, handball. Handball. Handball, yep. ref. Referee feels oh, the spot. Go. I don't know what the... I don't know what does it come off the body and onto the hand? Is it no hand ball? Is that right? It depends. Uh, call me a cynic. It depends what team you're operating for. <laughs> well, as we know, Tarkos, Brian, you just couldn't predict this league. No, absolutely. The games in this league. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it wasn't that bad. Wasn't it that bad? No, it's not. Never a red card in your life, referee. Nonsense. That's from absolutely Alan nonsense, referee. Kyle Govan went in for the ball nonsense. there, and I'll tell you what, that was the steady That's a terrible pinch. decision. Uh, Jamie's right enough, I agree with Jamie. Absolutely ridiculous sending off by the ref. Jamie just got to need to control his emotions here. Now you can hear the, the home crowd, obviously partisan, and here comes uh, the uh, referee for the red card. Uh, ridiculous. So Absolute. things go from bad to worse for Sumar, you have to say, it. I think been, Alan, Newland, does, does Alan Michael, Newland's got that wrong on two occasions. He has Mike. absolutely lost the plot here, I'm afraid to say. Absolutely lost the plot. Now here's Jinky with a chance oh, to, to run him. No, Jinky, no. Two of them, Jinky, in the far side. That's a good That's ball. That's a great ball. Oh, just too much. Matty Grant gets to it. Lifts it go across. On. Yes, yes and it's a goal. That's the way, that's the way, way to reply to them. That's the way to reply to them, Lawrence. Three one to the Blues. That is the way to reply. I think that was Sal, was it, Brian? I think it was Sal, but no matter what, three one to the Blues. Seventy-three minutes gone. As you say, what a way to hit back, Brian. Lovely ball in from Matty Grant. I'm pretty sure it was Sal. I think it was, Gall I think it was Gallagher. Was it Gallagher. Yeah, yeah. Again, these shots—it's really hard to tell. 
Well, I can change Sal to Gal. It could, it could have been Sal. He scored. <laughs> Come on. Steady off up the left now. Danger here. And that's a goal. Very, very simple goal. Yeah. Oh, now just keep it, keep it, keep it. And when you go in, go to the corner face. flag, Anton. Anton Brady. That's a boy. Heads for the corner. The and that's yes, and that's it. The Blues have held on for three points. And you can absolutely tell by the reaction at Steer Park that the fans think they're half done to by Stenhouse Muir and the referee. That sending off is one that will be questioned long by Stranraer fans. And it's a... It's a yeah, it just made Stranraer more determined, I think, Brian. Yeah, the fans. absolutely. Brilliant performance for Stranraer Lawrence. So full time at Stranraer. Stranraer 3, Stenhouse Muir 2.